Happy Tractor Power fans, this video comes to you from a Western Kentucky cornfield where a Class 8 473 horsepower 400 bushel John Deere S780 combine equipped with tracks is harvesting the crop with a 12 row 30 inch folding Gearinghoff Patriot corn head. Gearinghoff's Patriot Cornhead offers several harvesting enhancements, including wide angle deck plates, a precision engineered gathering system, end row augers, stainless steel wear strips, and factory installed stubble lights. During this video, I will take viewers up in the cab of the John Deere S780 Combine to visit with the farmer to talk to him about the advantages he finds in operating Gearinghoff's 12-row folding premium corn head. But first, let's head out to the field so you can see and hear all this corn harvesting action. cab of a John Deere S780 combine. It's equipped with a 12 row 30 inch Gearinghoff Patriot corn head. It's folded up right now to 15 feet wide, the size of a six row corn head, and we're going to watch it unfold from inside the cab as it enters the next field. see the outside rows unfold pretty quickly. This 
center it must be a tremendous time saver oh, getting from place to place. It saves a lot of time not having to take those headers off. It's uh, you know we there for a while we run eight row heads just for the simple fact of trying getting down the road. You know it's still small enough to get down the road. This this really allows us to pack a little larger head and and, uh, and get down the road a lot better. A lot easier to coordinate too. You don't have to pick up trucks and header wagons and yeah, finding a place to pull it in to the field and hook up. Yeah, it, uh, it, it makes you appreciate cornhead over a draper head or something. They don't have that luxury. So in addition to being easy to transport and speeding things up, it looks like it does a pretty good job in the field as well. It really does. I mean, we, we really like, since we're uh, raising wheat behind this corn, we want that residue down close to the ground, get it, get it to the smaller particle size we can to break down, and then that way we're off and ready for the next next crop, which will be wheat, and uh, just trying to get to as much of that material down the ground. And if we do work, we try to get it incorporated into the top, of, top inch or so of soil. I know that just filming out there on the ground from year to year, I see a lot of this corn residue left over even a year later because it, it doesn't break down like it used to, which is good for the standing plant, but it's good to size it up with a corn header like this. Yeah. We're very fortunate here in the southern part of the state here to have weather that deteriorates the stuff pretty good, but now if I was up north in, in uh, Nebraska or somewhere like that, yeah, they, their stalks, they, they, they could really utilize a head like this to get it broke down. Get that stuff broke down a lot better for them as well. This big John Deere combine is equipped with a 28 and a half foot unloading auger that pours corn out at 3.8 bushels per second. It offers plenty of space between the 12 row corn head and the grain cart, allowing the harvest to move nonstop. What kind of speed does this corn header let you harvest at? If it's really, really good corn, probably about that four and a half mile high range. Otherwise, it, it wants to throw it on. We could run the we run shaft speed faster, but the box is telling us over here that hey, we're fast enough. So we we run in range four here on this thing, and we can we can run somewhere around that four mile an hour. At, we're running 3.6 now, but it just depends. It's 256 bushel corn, so we're just, uh, just kind of cruising through it. We don't want to throw it out the back. Well, it does a nice job moving through it. Now I also noticed what are what are the spinning cones on the on the corner of the on the ends of the header? Uh, if, if we get into any down corn or logic, or what we can do is that, that, that helps bring it back over into the machine. Uh, whenever, whenever we get get into some corn like that, we I don't know. There's some of this that'll be down. You'll see it feed it over. We can we can adjust the speed off the real speed on, on that. How fast we want those to run? I just like them to run a little a little slow. It, they do help.
Hearing Haas 12 row Patriot Cornhead offers a lot of advantages during the corn harvest, including the folding feature, ear picking, as well as stalk processing. One of the standout features that I noticed in the field is the Cornhead's factory installed stubble lights. This is the first Cornhead that I have come across that actually has built in headlights that gives the operator additional visibility of the corn as it's being picked. The lights on the combine cab are very handy at night for lighting up the field, but this corn head lights up the harvest process right where it's happening. I hope you've enjoyed spending some time out in this western Kentucky cornfield during the harvest with the John Deere S780 Combine and 12-row Gearinghoff Patriot Cornhead. Does your farming operation use Gearinghoff Cornheads to harvest your crop? I'd like to hear about the size head that you're running and the combine that operates it. Let me know about it in the comment section below this video. If you've enjoyed the video, consider subscribing to Big Tractor Power YouTube where there's over 1,000 videos of farm machines in action. As always, thank you for watching.